all right guys this is uh, a little different this is where we try to you know get out of the right race and make pimp decisions how to invest and uh you know stuff like that um so first what we do is create a room we can play with other people these people are online they can create a room um I can join somebody look this one's got two people out of four I can join if I wanted to uh, I can also create my own room just name it like if I want people to join I could just play join and they'll know to join but let's play a private game so I'm just gonna name it tiger and we gotta make it a password um, let's make it BTC for Bitcoin that way nobody gets in I will just create game I put my name for my little character and here we go so we got to choose a dream like what, what are we working for right there's a bunch of these as you go to uh, on these arrows it'll move the cheese here to these uh, life goals that you want to make so it doesn't really matter here you can choose whatever you want uh, this one's a yacht racing if you're into that but you know there's a bunch of dreams that you could do so let's just choose that one for now so now we start over here this is basically our day-to-day -day job where we work we pay bills we try to invest uh, when uh, an opportunity comes up and uh, we try to make some uh, investments that are gonna provide us with cash flow enough so that we don't have to work anymore where like all our investments are paying for our bills and expenses and that's when we get out and we start working on these on this track so if you click here on financial statements after I guess you have to roll first but this will tell you who you are so right now I'm an, I'm an engineer I make four thousand dollars four thousand nine hundred dollars every paycheck um, I guess this is per month um, every yellow yellow uh, space here is uh, a paycheck <laughs> And then we got we pay taxes 1050 we have a home mortgage payment of 700 car loan 140 credit cards so these are all our our expenses every time we get paid this much comes out of our paycheck and then we get left with uh, this much so this it tells you here so it added all this up right here and then this is what we get to keep every paycheck so right now we're starting with 400 in our bank. Uh, every time I get paid, we're gonna get 1750, and then we can start either paying off this debt or or um, investing in uh, in some assets that are gonna uh, give us more cash flow to counter this these uh, these expenses. So let's see what we got right here. We landed on a, an opportunity. Uh, we don't have much cash so we can't really take it but let's check what 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 we got mutual funds these are kind of like stocks you can buy them uh, it doesn't give you any cash flow so I don't really buy these unless uh, it costs like the one dollar the five dollars or sometimes up to ten dollars that's the max that I would buy but if it's five dollars or one dollar I I'll, I'll jump on it um, and here is the uh, the range in which you can trade it for so later on let's say you buy it you can trade it for up to $30 later so right now I'm gonna pass I don't want that um, if you want to pay for any loans you can uh, repay here if you want to borrow money you can borrow here you can just say how much you want to borrow and then you'll have another um, another debt here that you're paying and that loan's gonna be over here somewhere and it'll say how much you're paying 
uh, how much you borrowed and it'll tell you here how much you're paying every every time you get paid so i don't need any loans right now we're gonna cancel uh if you want to repay any of your loans you can you can come here and you can select which ones you want to pay but right now i only have four hundred dollars so i can't really pay it every time you want to pay something you got to pay in increments of thousand dollars so let's cancel that let's end this and then let's take another turn now i got paid that's a paycheck if you take a look at the statement i have two thousand dollars now so if i want to pay this it'll take out um, this here this $50 I'll be saving $50 every check if I pay that off so let's see what we can do let's pay that off and see how that goes pay off loan yes okay so now you can see I have a thousand dollars left and that debt is gone I'm saving $50 here we can end our turn roll and we got a deal opportunity. Stock, okay, here we go. If I had some stock, some some A, some M A M Y T for you. If I had some of that, it says it's reverse split. Company recognizes massive losses due to over. So basically, whatever amount you bought would have been, you would have lost half of that. Okay, we got another deal. Okay, here we go. Five dollars. Look at that. Now, let's play it safe. Okay, we're just gonna buy. We're gonna buy five dollars. We're gonna buy all of this. How much? How many can we get? All right, let's do that. Two hundred twenty-five. Let's buy that. So now you can see here, we got 225 of that stock for $5. So next time we we come across this stock, it may be more, it may be less. So if it's more, we can sell it. Okay, let's keep going. Let's see what we got. Okay, small deal. Look, here we go. It just came up again, right? So now it costs $40. I can sell this for $40. I got it for $5 each, 200 of them. And I can sell them for forty dollars each. So let's see how much I get. Look, I'm getting nine thousand dollars for selling it. That was a, I got lucky actually. It doesn't really doesn't always come up that quick. So I'm gonna sell that because that's the highest you can never sell it. So if you don't take that opportunity, you're probably not gonna get it uh, soon. If if you get it. So now we have a little bit of money. We got ten thousand dollars. That's good. Um, let's say you want to pay your bills. So let's repay. Let's pay the car loan. How about that? Pay the car loan. Uh, actually, these these you have to pay in full. When you when you borrow a loan, it'll come here. Then you can pay in, in increments of thousands. But these... Um, these uh liabilities here you have to pay them in full so you pay off you have to pay it off now let's see what we got left we have three thousand left we almost could pay this off okay let's keep going birthday party i'm up oh, i'm gonna spend a hundred dollars on a birthday party okay okay we got paid now we can repay that look at that let's repay that or actually pay it off I mean now what are we looking at here's every this is it like you can't pay off taxes you can pay off a mortgage but I need I need to get 75,000 and pay it off but the other expenses you cannot get it get rid of you can't get rid of those so all, all I have right now is the mortgage and um, look at look at my cash flow right now so it's it's almost um, almost half of what I'm making I'm keeping so that means I'm gonna start stacking money quick or quicker I should say okay when you donate to charity you get um, 
you get kind of get a, a a boost you donate 10 percent of what you have or total income but i don't have that right now um is it total income yeah donate of total income to roll two dice so you can speed up um, the process quicker so let's see if we can donate yeah what did it take yeah it took some money okay so i can i can go from here i can get paid here and maybe even here so i get paid twice if i roll a pretty good um like if i roll a 12 or something high but it can also backfire because you might land on a on a kid and then you that's a liability so let's do two watch okay rumor of layoff go back to school for added skills pay 220 dollars okay Um, I don't remember how many times you get to do this. Um, you use two die when you get uh, when you donate to charity, but well, let's keep going. I think you get three. Okay, this is bad right here because this is gonna wipe you out. Pay a full set of your expenses and lose a turn. So a full set of my expenses is seven hundred. This is and how much is it gonna take? So it should only take 700. If I have 5,075, it should take 700. So I should have like, I should have left like 4,200 or something. Nope, it took more than that. Why did it take more? Oh, because it added these two. I thought, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I just keep looking at this one because I don't have any liability. So yeah, it takes 2,000. Um, yeah, this, this amount. So I have to pay a full set of my expenses. And I lose the turn. And I lose another turn. And then I go. Alright. Deal opportunity. I don't have any stocks anymore. But business is dramatically and company is... What? Business is up dramatically and company is doing well. So if you had this stock that means your um the amount that you have would double so you'd be making more money when you sell it okay we got another deal opportunity oh look at this so house for sale two bed uh three bedrooms two bath Okay, market has crashed. No bids uh, at last week's auction. It costs fifty thousand. It brings negative cash flow, but you don't you don't pay anything. So uh, this could be good, but it could be also be like a drag. So you'll be be losing a hundred dollars every check, but it doesn't cost you anything to get it, and then somebody can buy it from you, so you can sell it. So let's just take it. Why not? So when you buy an asset, it puts the asset over here. So now how it calculates is you get paid $4,900 plus whatever you have here. In this case, we're going negative. So we're taking away from that minus these expenses as well. And then you have, you have it over here as well showing you what the cost is for that asset um, you didn't pay that but that's that's basically what you would be uh, borrowing well, yeah if you were to buy it you'll be borrowing this much and this is what it would give you in cash flow so let's continue okay got another deal opportunity Stocks, ten dollars. Um, I think that's a little too much for me. Uh, um, I don't want. No, I don't want to buy it for ten dollars. I'm gonna skip. So here, big deals are the same thing, but you get obviously bigger deals. Like you, you get like a deal, like an apartment building for like 
you, you put down like 20,000 or 30,000, something like that. Uh, smaller dealers are like, what well, it tells you right here. Deals cost 5,000 or less. These cost 6,000 or more, but usually you get like pretty high end, higher uh, deals. So here's another house. Uh, cost 50,000. It's gonna bring in $200 cash flow. And I only have to pay 4,000. So if I buy this, I'm actually going to be uh, getting $100 more because then I'll go um, I cancel this out and I keep another 100 So let's buy it. So now we got to keep track of this. We have one, one house. They both will have two houses, same size. They both got 50, but we have to keep, uh, keep in mind which one is the one that's cash flowing and which one's the negative. So when we come to sell it, we sell the right one. Stock, okay. Cost 30. That's too expensive. Don't want it. Damn, downsize again. So I need to pay 2,800, right? the turn is the turn let's go okay here we go so sewer line breaks uh, water everywhere at your apex I don't have an apex so I'm safe you see you don't have you have no assets that match this market so if I had an apex I would be I would be in trouble I would have to pay some some uh, repairs here with small deal. stocks thirty dollars too much so basically the game is like how fast can you get out of this rat race right so right now we got we've been playing for like about maybe 15 minutes or so or maybe less um, and our cash flow hasn't even increased that much like at all basically we have to get to this much cash flow in order to get out once we reach that we get out so there's ways to do it faster that you, you got to take more risk but right now right now we're playing it safe so here's an apartment house buyer I don't have an apartment building it'll it says right here so when you do have a, 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 a property that investors are looking for they will light up over here it'll tell you you have It'll show you right here that you have an asset that you can sell. Another opportunity. Preferred stock. Cost 1200 Cash flow 10 Um, I don't really like buying these because it's, it's only $10 extra. I don't know. I don't, I don't see the point of it. Um, also like the... the called the CDs um, certificate of deposit they're the same thing like you just basically put your money away and you're earning some interest but it's, it's not worth it okay this is a bad thing because you had a baby now you have $250 extra right here so yeah you can't get away with it but you can only get max of three that's it. So once you get your three, you keep landing on baby. You don't you don't gain anymore. Man, I keep landing on opportunities. Sounds good. Start a company part time. So the good thing about these is that sometimes you'll come across a buyer that's looking for a business, and if you have one that you started, you might be able to sell it. But that is, those are kind of rare sometimes, so I, I prefer not to. But you could. Sometimes you'll get lucky and you'll you'll make some money. Ten dollars for the stock. No. I keep landing on deals. That's good. Forty dollars for the stock. No. Plex buyer. I don't have a Plex. Okay. Play your lucky lottery numbers with $100. Okay. Don't 
donate to charity. Yes, let's donate. Roll two. Uh, what do you guys think? Big deal. Let's try a big deal. See, this is this is why I'm telling you, the down payment is 32. If you want to get it, you can get it, but you're gonna have to get a loan for the rest. So, is it gonna be worth it? How much am I gonna look? It's 32, so I need to get like over twenty thousand dollars, right? Twenty-one thousand or something. And then on that twenty-one thousand, I'm gonna be paying two thousand one hundred dollars. So it's gonna be double what it's gonna bring me. So it doesn't make sense. This is too small, deal. House for sale. This one costs five thousand, and it brings me that much. So this is good. You can buy it. Downsize again. Three thousand dollars. Small deal. Ten dollars. Now I'll pass. Anniversary. Spent two hundred dollars. Small deal. Find a great deal. Uh, what am I looking for? A company, a bot transfer manager. Okay. Current tenant has. Okay, this is good. Has been on the market six months. And uh, okay. Cash flow two fifty. You're only paying two thousand, and it's forty five thousand. Yeah, this is good. Let's bring in some cash flow. Now look at my cash flow. It's increasing right here. Plex buyer. See if we if we would have bought that Plex, we could have sold it to this guy, but we would have been losing money. Until then, condo for sale. Negative. It brings you negative. It costs you five thousand. It's gonna cost you five thousand dollars, and you're gonna be going negative. Um. See at this point, how many, how much have we paid with this negative, right? Like take that, take that into consideration. Like let's say we already went ten turns after getting this, we've lost thousand um, dollars. Do we want to get another house that's going to be negative? Yes and no, but mostly no because we're going to be going negative and. We don't know when we're gonna sell it, but let's just let's just buy it just so just for the experience. Let's buy it. We're, we're we're going negative on these two, but we're still positive cash flow. We're still positive cash flow, right? We're still um, keeping almost half of our paycheck, so we're still good. Another great deal. Look at this. 2000 Yes, I can buy it. I have enough. And it's bringing 200 So that counters that the other house that's negative. So let's get it. Stocks. Do you want to buy it for 30 Nope. Another deal. $5 for the stock. Um, okay. Let's buy it. Can we buy? How much can we buy? Um, nine, two, nine, three. I want to buy everything. There we go. Perfect. Buy that. Okay, so now we got this 970 shares, five dollars each. So when this NYT for you got, uh, comes out again, hopefully for even double or more, and then we'll sell it. 
uh, here. Okay, so I had to take out a loan because I only had five hours left. And well, you can only yeah, you need to pay eighty dollars. So every time you take out a loan is in increments of thousands. You can't take out any more, any less than a thousand. So as soon as I get paid, I'm paying that off. Stock for you, twenty dollars each. No. Let's repay that. Let's repay that loan. Pay three hundred and fifty tax audit. Okay. Small deal. Ooh, here we go. Doubled. I just doubled that, right? So what did I buy? Well, how much did I spend? Four thousand? So I'm gonna get eight thousand something, nine thousand. Yep, sell it. Here we go. House buyer. This guy's looking for something that I have. So now we can select which one we want to sell. Look, if we select that first one, he's going to give us 40000 right? So if you think about it, how much have we spent so far in going negative? Maybe like $2,000, 3000 or something. But we're about to make... We're about to make some money right now. If we sell it. Look at that. We sold it for forty thousand. Now we gotta look for the for the other one that's going negative. This one, right? So we go one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Is it the condo? Oh, because it's this is a condo. He's looking for a house. So we can't sell that one. But here's what here's what we do. I know this is providing us with cash flow, but with the money that we're going to sell, look at, we could sell all of these houses. So we're just going to sell all of them. Look at that. Another 40. We're going to make money so quick right now. And then we can hit the big deals. That's when we start moving. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at that. I can pay off my house if I want but I don't see the point in it. We have enough to like make some really good deals. Look at this, big deal. Now all you do is just buy stuff like because you have enough. Like this is already like halfway of what your expenses will be. You know? Look at that. See? With ju just one purchase, I'll, I'll back to the same with one property. Actually, this is a partnership. So, uh, my paycheck's still the same. My expenses are still kind of the same because I have a child. Uh, but I have a lot of money now. So, we can keep uh, investing. Inflation hits. If I have this kind of asset, let me see. Inflation goes. Goes to 10% interest rates, climb to 200% on home loans. You finance with variable rate. You must give your three bedroom, three bath house back to the bank. You lose your cash flow. Oh, okay, so we we made a good move. Because if we had a house, three bedroom, two bath, all of our houses, they would have been repoed or something, uh, from what I'm understanding. Because all your houses would have to go back to the bank. So, so we made a good move. We sold them. Now let's make another big deal. Cost forty thousand, and we're making to look. This I'm already gonna be out of the rat race with this just just this one purchase. Look, done. I'm out. Out of the rat race. Now we're over here. We're playing in the big leagues now. Now we're buying businesses. We're buying franchises. We're buying. You know, things that are going to make us like $200,000, like not $200,000, but like, you know, $8,000 a month, things like that. This is somebody else's dream. You can't really do another thing. There we go. Give to charity. Same thing as the other one, except this one gives you three die instead of two. And it's, I think it's unlimited. So yes, if we have $100,000 to donate, 
which we do. So what happens is when you exit the rat race here, it multiplies, I forgot how they, how they calculate it, but they multiply whatever you had left times something and they give you that much. That's, that's how much you start with um, here on the, on the fast track. So let's donate. We use three because we want to get to a payday and we want to get to uh, one of these green ones to purchase. So we don't want to land on audit or whatever this is. I forgot what it is, but we don't want to land on that one. And we don't want to land on that one. And we don't want to land on that one. Those take money away from you. And that's exactly what happened. Audit. Yeah, that's the audit. Let's go again. Get paid. Let's go again. Here we go. Cruise in Mediterranean. Okay, that's somebody else's dream. So, in order to win the game, uh, here's our cheese, right? This is we have to either land on it and be able to buy it, or we have to have enough cash flow here to win. So, either we buy our dream, or we uh, when we land on it, or we uh, we reach our goal of cash flow, our passive passive income. So right now we're just blazing through it. There we go. Now we can buy this. Cookware and commercial, fifty thousand dollars a month cash flow if you roll a four or higher on a die. But I have to put in. Cost is two hundred twenty-five thousand. Cash flow would be fifty thousand. So it's a risk. You take a risk. So I have two million. Wow, I have two million. I have two million dollars. So I can afford to pay that. Let's let's buy it and see if we get lucky. I rolled a two. I lost. Okay, that's 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 fine. It was worth the risk. Fifty thousand a month. Yeah. Here we go again. Uh, truck park. So I can buy this business. Fifty uh, five thousand dollars a month cash flow, forty percent cash on cash return. So it costs one hundred and fifty, and it's gonna give me five thousand dollars. And here we go. I got it. I have a truck parts maker. It's giving me five thousand dollars a month, or uh, every paycheck. Let's go. Okay, chicken franchise. It's gonna give me ten thousand dollars a month. It's gonna cost me three hundred thousand dollars. Let's buy it. So that's all you do now. You just you have the money. You just keep buying. Biotech company. Buy five hundred shares at ten cents. If you roll a five or six. Shares go to uh, shares go to one per share. You get five hundred thousand cash from the bank. Roll less than a five, get zero. So this is a pretty good return. I'm paying fifty thousand to take this risk. The possible return is five hundred thousand. So let's buy it. I rolled a six. I gained five hundred thousand. So that's good. Burger franchise. It's gonna give me nine thousand five hundred dollars every check. It's gonna cost me three hundred thousand, which I have more than enough. So let's buy it. Look, we're almost halfway there. Pizza franchise. Seven thousand dollars a month. I have enough money to buy it. Let's get it. So there are many ways that you can you can strategize to to get out of the rat race quick. So you just got to play around with it. Think of a strategy and don't go broke. I think the fastest I've done it is like 
four minutes, but I was like blazing through it. And uh, I think I took out a loan or something. And it, there's a there's a um, there's a a strategy to that, uh, but it's risky. It's really risky. Uh, T-shirt store. Let's buy it. Okay. Cost two hundred. Yeah, let's buy it. So I'm almost, I'm almost done. One more, one more purchase, and I think I, I, I win. I'll have enough to buy it. There we go. I already have this, so I need to land on something else. I mean, at a point, there's a point where you're gonna have every business on the fast track, and you. You won't have enough to um, to buy it, to buy the dream, or, or finish your your passive income goal. In that case, you just have to keep going until you land on your on your dream, and then you buy it. Like, okay, see, here we go. I just I just won because I made I met my target. Look, my my target was four ten. And I made 413. So I win. I win the game. That's how you play it. This is this was like the conservative um, way to go. Not much risk. Um, and making some good decisions. Uh, there's other ways to do it and get out of the rat race quick. But there's more risk, more risk to it. Um, you know, there's strategies with more risk. Risk. And strategies that are you know less risky but it takes longer to get out so at this point we just hit quit and we can start another game if we want to but I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it here uh, I'll pl probably play play again um, another day I, I like to play this game once in a while uh, it keeps me uh, keeps me with ideas about investing and stuff uh, kind of like it so Anybody have any questions, hit me up. Uh, you can follow me also on Instagram at TigerRodriguez1 before I uh, end, it, end the stream. Thank you guys for being a part of it. Uh, if you guys want to see more of this game, hit me up. Let me know.